This week, the UK Supreme Court ruled unanimously that Boris Johnson's unprecedented decision to suspend Parliament was illegal. Opposing politicians are calling for Johnson to resign, or if he refuses, to hold a vote of no confidence. But even if Parliament passes the motion, Boris Johnson could still refuse to leave because there's no law that explicitly requires him to. Britain doesn't have a proper written constitution. Architect Matthew Taylor is concerned that Johnson is flouting the conventions of Britain's unwritten constitution. In the past, it's relied a lot of trust and good faith and belief that the people in charge are doing the right thing. But if they switch to not doing it, it's very easy to start abusing a system like that because there aren't enough checks and balances in place. That is the most well-informed, thoughtful person to ever dress like the EU flag. <laughs> The British government relies on precedents and conventions that for centuries have just been understood and respected. But now, Britain has this. You lied to the people of London in your own. Oh, age. get stuck. <laughs> Parents, don't let your kids play sports with Boris Johnson and Britain, write down your shit. A written constitution is the only way to clarify laws, the role of the monarchy, and to prevent this peaky blinder from calling squatters rights on Downing Street. That's our show. Good night, everyone.